It's a nice day. Well, it's been a nice day today. It's, it's about uh, four o'clock now. Uh, the end of uh, October. The um, nights are drawing in. It's been almost a uh, yeah. It's almost an Indian summer at the moment. I hope it will carry on for the rest of the weekend. We've got um, got a certain individual underneath there who's um, been recuperating for the last month after being attacked by a dog and she's exploring the garden. Well she's been forced to explore the garden because I've shoved her out here but um, it's time to get on with her, get back on the, in the saddle. Anyway yeah, the, uh, this is my uh, the winter garden I was doing a month and a half ago. We've got the little um, metal green posts, they're, um, they're for keeping cats out because cats will dig your stuff up and uh, to use the thing as a toilet. Anyway we've got um, these spring onions, they're not really spring onions, they're um, uh, Egyptian onions, top setting onions but the um, I've just taken the top sets, planted them as a bunch and I'll be eating them as um, spring onions. I've had one picking from the coriander so far since I planted it and it keeps growing back, it's doing really nicely. Though I've noticed some of them have been struggling. Well one there, now look at these two, these were lovely little plants. I'm wondering whether I've overwatered them. But uh, yeah, I'm not happy with that. Anyway, yeah, so this is um, edible mallow from real seeds. Uh, this is self-seeded in the in the garden. We've got some bigger ones here. And uh, yeah, if you, I don't know whether people, you, you might not be into it because it's slightly, it's a little bit like um, ladies' fingers. It's a little bit uh, mucilaginous, but uh, it's productive. If you're wondering what the flower looks like, they're they're rubbish, but but overall, I think the plant's quite attractive. I've also got some lettuce. This is a marvel of four seasons. Uh, Bought for its hardiness and some uh, beetroot which I'm growing for leaves and nice in a salad. Also got gerbil, very hardy. Uh, this lettuce, marvel of four seasons, hardy as well. And then we've got that um, Chinese leaf, oriental leaf, that's hardy too. So it's a winter garden. Uh, this this will die back. This is sweet Sicily, but um, it's very much like chervil in taste and looks. Um, but uh, this one's a perennial, and it dies back, which chervil doesn't. And I think the flavour is stronger as well. It's very refreshing. Uh, what I do is I chop that out fine um, with a bit of coriander and put it in, whip it into an egg for breakfast. So. Um, some lettuce as well. There's a lady ship running for it. She really doesn't like being out here. Who can blame her? She got savaged. Yeah, uh, got some spring onions. Uh, proper spring onions. These are Japanese bunching. This is my um, allegedly hardy chili, which is gonna gonna be tested this winter. It's got some lovely chilies on it. Great big red jobs and it's still flowering so um, I'm gonna put some fleece over it it's allegedly takes minus five it's called um, uh, ricotto ricotto chili it grows in the mountains that's why it's minus five hardy It's, uh, I've had a lot of fun in the greenhouse. Well, it's, it's been well, it's been fun. It's been whether it's successful or not, another matter. Um, 
the had a lot of tomatoes, half of them split, then they all caught blight. But uh, I still got a lot of good eating out of it. Um, these are the remains of my um, cucumbers. Now they've been um, very enjoyable. I've never managed to uh, get cucumbers to work. But somebody pointed out you've got to keep feeding them and it worked. Uh, so um, I may very well have the entire greenhouse full of cucumbers next year. Thoroughly enjoyed that. So, uh, so, but now it's the end of the season. Now it's time to tear it all out. The um, these um, uh, peppers have been quite interesting. Uh, still got peppers on them. Barancio, those. That's a barancio as well. Uh, so um, I'm going to dig one of these up and put it in a pot. Uh, overwinter it. Uh, I've enjoyed looking at them and I've enjoyed eating them, so um, that's all that matters. Anyway, it's time to start um, pulling all this apart and cleaning up, uh, ready for for next year. take um, seed from uh, when keeping this going but I, what I didn't realise was I had more than one oh, bleeding earwigs in there uh, the um, so I'm going to keep the do the uh, cut these open for seed for next year I have thoroughly enjoyed cucumbers so um, it's been a good plant as well so uh, I'll put that somewhere separate How to clean the glass. Look at the state of it. And that's it. Um, that's it. That's me. Uh, job done for today. The, uh, the clocks go back uh, next. Uh, well, this this weekend. So it's essentially the end of the season, which is very sad. I mean, it's very sad to see the um, the greenhouse empty. There you go. It's uh, onwards and upwards. It'll be. Uh, it means there's, there'll be a new year coming. But anyway, it's nice and. Um, Lot more light in here now. It's a lot more like a greenhouse instead of a grotty, I don't know, dust house. Anyway, yeah. So, um, I always like uh, filming through glass, through a greenhouse, and into the rest of the garden. Anyway, yes. So, um, so yeah, I, I'm sure I'll do some more um, more work tomorrow, and I'll let you know how um, I'll get on. So. Um, so uh, yeah, I'll sign off now then, um, uh, see you soon.